Jordan, we're Professional Development League 2 champions. How does that feel? Amazing. Literally amazing. I can't describe it. Like, two years in a row, can't beat it. Best. It's the best feeling ever. Like, for me and the team, it's everything. Like, means the world to me. For long, for long spells during the game tonight, it looked like it wasn't going to go our way, but we showed real character, didn't we, to, to keep going and then get the goal. Full credit to the boys, like, they're the ones that run, run and run until they couldn't run anymore. Like, Chris, he kept going until he couldn't go. You got everyone, everyone played a part in it, even the injured boys, like, the people who couldn't be involved because of injuries, like, Dan Barry picked up an in injury in the semi. He, he played a massive part in the league for everyone, even everyone did. I mean, in extra time, you weren't really massively involved too much, were we? We were dominating that much. No, no, it was it was quite a difficult one because I had to focus more, like, and concentrate on everything much harder than I do normally because I'm not involved as much as I would like to be. But credit to the team, I guess. And then when penalties came, you you came into your own yeah. as you always seem to do. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know how I do it. I just I have to read them a little bit, but not a lot I can do. It's quite quite a hard thing to deal with on your own. Like you're on your own, you got to rely on the boys quite a lot to score and keep us going. But I've got to do my job and save theirs. What is it that you that you look for when players step up? Is it the way they look? Just, is yeah, it the, way, the way they look. Do they look anxious, nervous? Like, look at how they plant the ball. See if they can do anything differently with it all. Just you have to read like quite a lot of things, like their body languages and everything. It's quite difficult, but you can get used to doing it after a while. And their first. Three penalties, I think it was. All went to your left. You dived right yeah. every time, but you you stuck with going right, and yeah, you, you stuck, got your rewards. Exactly, I kept going. Like I had to keep. I didn't read the run-ups properly. I could tell. Like the penalties weren't even good penalties, so I just had to keep keep focusing on it and seeing what they did. Were you tempted to go left when yeah, when they kept I was, going there? I was very tempted, but glad I stuck with it in the end. What was it that kept you? Kept you going right. Just kept watching him. One at the first one, the guy looked really nervous for me. Like, and I was like, "Yeah, I know where you're going," and just went committed myself to it completely. It must have been a great feeling getting the first one and then saving oh, the second one, done. knowing that that we'd done it. Unbelievable! Like, literally, it was the best feeling in the world. And I've done it twice to get us into the final, and then pushing us through and winning the final. It's unbelievable. And to get your hands on on the trophy, how did that feel? Oh, it feels great. It's the second year in a row, like I can't knock it, can't fault anyone, anyone in the team, it's brilliant. It must make all the, all the hard work seem oh, worthwhile. Definitely, definitely, all the long days at the training ground makes everything worthwhile at the end of the day.